This is the Bishop Don Magic Wand, chairman of the board of famous players everywhere, and you're listening to Reach Around Radio. Can you dig it? This is the Bishop Magic Don Magic Wand. Step your guy up. Step your guy up. y'all. It's Reach Around Radio. It's RTD. Taking two hosts and combining them into one super host. Okay. <laughs> we at Club Fluffies. It's under new management now. Mm. So we playing new music. We're going to play a little something like this. I oh, can't lose with this one. Oh, okay. <laughs> when I feel the cold. Oh, sing it. Y'all want me. And when I feel I can't go on. You come and hold me. Oh, my God. These chicks are Just hot. Just you and me forever. Come on, Tita. Smile, <laughs> Sarah. <laughs> it's a great song. Guys. It's a great selection. Great. Well, yeah. Won't you smile for one for me, Sarah? That was a jam. Hall and Oates. Jimmy was. I like still a jam. jam. If you feel like leaving. Come on, boy. You know the song. You know you can go. Was this playing when he pulled over? Why don't you stay <laughs> until ah. tomorrow? I want to be with you forever. <laughs> We're so cold in, uh -oh. even after I told him that I had to still work with him. <laughs> Hilarious. Can you pass me a pen? I still love you, though. I'm going to pick you up How at you eight. Wow. <laughs> yeah, I still had to work with him, so it was like that awkward Aww. awkwardness. At the elevator. <laughs> you be careful. Press seven, please. Hilarious. I still love you. <laughs> Forever. Forever. You cannot mess with people at work. Nah. Mm -mm. Anyway. <laughs> you all right over there? Yeah. I'm a, you having a moment? <laughs> you are, huh? No. We no, have, it's okay if you have a moment. My nose is yeah. running. Your nose is spotting. Right, he's crying. <laughs> so my nose is spotting. Aw, you still love me. Do we have any calls? Oh, I love you. Carla, what's your name and where are you calling from? Carla, what's your name and where are you calling from? Hey, what's up? This is Big L from New York. Hey, hey Big, Big L. L. What it do, what it do, what it do? <laughs> I'm chilling, man. What's about you? What about you? <laughs> Yo, uh, I got to say a shout out to uh, Poetess. That's my girl on uh, Wars with Friends. I'm oh, okay. Am I whooping you or what? Uh, actually, you've been kind of beating me the past few games. Oh, okay. <laughs> Wait, what's your name? Big L. I mean, on... Kigalio. Kigalio. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I read that. Hello. Yeah, you yeah, she's me? like, yeah, yeah. Yeah, I beat you. I beat you. Yeah. Claudia quit a long time ago. She couldn't hang. Uh, actually, no. I was using my passport and traveling uh, overseas, so I wasn't really Hilarious. having internet on my phone. <laughs> <laughs> I, oh, time, so I was, I was so talking that's your about, excuse, huh? I was talking to other people. You see my Facebook, boy? You uh, cannot, hilarious. You cannot <laughs> spell types of wine. Yeah. <laughs> it's illegal. In words with you. <laughs> I was busy, boy. Uh, well, all right. Well, I'll see you on Words with Friends. Yeah, 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 yeah. Um, uh, by the way, yo, I gotta say what's up to RT. Oh, uh, what's up, man? Yo, every, yo, I listened to one of the old shows recently, mm -hmm. and when you did the Family Guy voice, oh. <laughs> like the, the old pedophile, <laughs> yo, I fell off my chair, man. <laughs> okay, yeah, yeah, RT's very I got some extra pop. <laughs> RT's hilarious. <laughs> yeah. Thank you, man. Yo, Big yo, yo, did you ever see the one where you said, this uh, is uh, I have a call. Why don't y'all come in and play who can drink the most time in LPM? <laughs> <laughs> uh, let's play a game to see who can drink the most time oh, in LPM. Big L got all the seasons. Uh, <laughs> That's funny. Thank you, Big L. You got L. the box set. Thanks, Big L. From take New one York. more call, and then we got a... Uh, Carla, what's Peter? your name, and where are you calling from? Hello? Carla, what's your name, where are you calling from? No, this is the Bishop Down Magic One. <laughs> Never mind. <laughs> it's right. Reach Around Radio, and yeah. it's about that time. And now, ladies and gentlemen, lend me your ears. Oh, what is you just going to let your coochie fall out like that? <laughs> <laughs> Teeter Sports Ticker right here on Reach Around Radio. <laughs> NFL Combines. 40 yard dashes. I see you looking at me. No, no. <laughs> hey, I looked at you too. See, see, see. It's happening. It's all good. Chris Johnson's 40 yard dash time is still intact. Yeah. 4.24 seconds. Wow, that's pretty fast. Two that's guys fast. ran 2.25 seconds, but they didn't get They didn't beat him. Mm. So he woke up and tweeted and said, Woo, 
It's great to be alive. <laughs> so congratulations on okay. that. Uh, Manti Teo, yeah, he ran it. I, I have a 4.82 that he ran the combine in for the linebackers. Good guys out there. Uh, the quarterback from uh, Florida State. Oh, yeah, they say he Yeah, he, 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 he got a strong arm. He can, he can do it all. He ran like a 4.6 as a quarterback. So That's that good. was so that R.G. Griffin type get down. Yep. Let's RG go to uh, MMA. What was that? MMA. M M A M M A M M A M M A. I can do that fast. M M A M M A M M A. The girls fight. They were the feature fight. Miss Ronda Rossi and Liz Chamachi. That was UFC 157. That produced 1.4 at the gate. She's attractive. You seen her? She's very beautiful. Yeah, woman, and she can whip that ass with the. Got that girl up out of there. I'll fight her. You fight her? Yeah, I'll fight her. Okay, well let's see if we can hook that up, RT. And in NASCAR, Jimmy Johnson, <laughs> Daytona, took it home. Danica Patrick, who had the, um, she came in eighth, but, you know, she had the pole position. Yeah, so first she woman to ever spot, get the pole position, right? But they took it from her. She's but doing she, her thing, though. Yeah, she's doing her thing. She won, uh, not won, but she led some laps in the race. It was good. Nice. So this is the Super Bowl of NASCAR, of the good Daytona. And they had the big wreck the down season. there. That oh, that was wreck? Saturday. Yeah. yeah mm. People got her tire in the stands, and, but the people came back. People came back. Good job. They let the beer down there. Let the beer down there. And my boy uh, Dale Earnhardt Jr. came in second. Car 88. That's my car right there. Okay. And NBA news. The Lakers are doing their thing. Metal World Peace, Kobe Bryant, the Black Uh-oh. Mamba. We're getting on track, Nikki Pam. We just lost. Yeah, they, uh, y'all lost tonight. <laughs> y'all lost tonight. Lakers are horrible. See, you don't do We're that. not horrible. You ain't They're a real horrible. fan. You ain't good either. Yeah, they're definitely not good. <laughs> no, we had a, we won three in a row and lost one. That's not bad. Yeah, three in one's good. Okay. And a uh, happy birthday to uh, Derek Rose for Chicago Bulls. He's there you go. There I hope he comes back. And practicing and getting ready to get so, back and do his thing. Yeah, D good. Rose, happy birthday. And that's Tita Sports Ticker right here on Reach Around. All right. Yo. That sound can only mean one thing. What's that? It's time for our game show. Which one? It's called Guess, Guess What, what Rays. So and pussy on the floor on the outside. And it's uterus by an umbilical cord. Here comes Jack it up behind 7-Eleven. <laughs> Bring it up the rear. <laughs> and it's the 15th kid down the back stretch. Uh, all right. <laughs> it's our game show where I read some news stories. And you have to listen to the details and guess the race of the person committing the crime. Okay. You like to join and play with us. Please help us with this game. Uh, all right. All right. Okay. <laughs> a KFC employee is mm. out of a job. Black. <laughs> <laughs> is out of a job after photos of the culprit making out with a plate of mashed potatoes ended up on Facebook. The mashed potatoes apparently were not served to a customer, but they had been shaped into a uh, woman's boobs. And the guy, you know, took pictures licking the <laughs> under, under boob of the mashed potato mammary before throwing it into an oven. The mm. photo became public information when it showed up on a Facebook page where it was shared 2,000 times and received more than 700 comments. <laughs> Once the news I like mashed potatoes. Broke, the yeah, suspect oh was uh, terminated. <laughs> an investigation confirmed the photos were taken after the restaurant was closed and none of the food was served. Hmm. KFC Corporation is sending representatives out to <laughs> speak on uh, behalf of the company. Make sure everybody knows that KFC will always listen, make America. It the highest operating standards when they serve you this kind of chicken meat. Guess <laughs> what race? I'm gonna have to go and say white on that one. Why would you say white? Mm, white meat. Because white boys tend to like breast. I can see if they made it a big ass, then it probably would have been but if that black. <laughs> Some titties look like ass. If they made a macaroni ass, they would have right. okay. So I'm gonna say white on this one. <laughs> RT. I know I think I think you're trying to throw those off with the KFC. Right. Dude, uh but I'm with POTUS because I can totally see and hear this guy go, dude, <laughs> I just made some mashed potato tits. Yeah. <laughs> Film this. Right. Like, that is totally a Caucasian thing. Uh, I'm guessing um, Midwest. Like I'm going white guy in the Midwest. I just okay. like to lick mm, things, regional. okay? It definitely is a KFC. I'm not lying. Okay. Uh, teeter. But do you have the state? <laughs> no. Okay. I did. Well, you I say KFC. Florida. It's probably Florida. <laughs> Everything's in Florida Everything. unless I say otherwise, okay? okay Florida gotcha. is the most jacked up state <laughs> in the country. Uh, mashed potatoes. Europeans love mashed potatoes. They, they love them. They will get a one piece okay, in yeah. a family size mashed potatoes. Yes. Potato. And no gravy either. No gravy. Just, give me, the, I don't need just that. give me the buds, boy. Yep. yep. Yeah, so yep. I'm going European. European. Yep. Okay, Anglo. Vlad. I think a white person did this. Now, why would you say white? 
because you know me being white myself. I oh, always, I didn't notice. You lick some tater titties. Okay. You know, I always created fake titties when I was younger. Yeah, so I I do it from time to time. Uh, look at our you know, I started to think maybe it was me at one point. <laughs> So everybody said white. Not sure everybody. if it was. All right. Yeah. Unanimous. All right. The man that licked tater, Dennis. titty taters, was in fact a white boy. Oh. Yeah. I should have oh, changed, changed, changed that one. I should have changed to ass. Does it say what state? <laughs> I have it. I'll find it later on. Hilarious. All right. Florida. Email me. Yeah. <laughs> uh, an ordinary Valentine's Day outing ended in bloodshed. Yeah. Uh-uh. For a man after his girlfriend bit off a large portion of his tongue. Oh. When he went for a kiss. Wow. The 51 year old woman and her 47 year old boyfriend got into a lover spat after returning home from a date. The woman asked the man to leave, at which point the man put on his shoes and headed for the door. Before leaving, he made a last-ditch attempt to patch things up. He told her they should stop fighting because it was a holiday, and he went to kiss her. That's when the woman bit off a large portion of his tongue. Oh, shit. The victim took off towards the sink with the woman just behind him. After she removed his tongue from her mouth, she tossed it on the counter, and her boyfriend stuffed it into a bag with ice. He then called 911. I'm going to leave that. Unfortunately, the doctors at the hospital were unable to reattach the tongue. Oh, 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 it seems God. the man is still able to speak somewhat. 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 Oh. <laughs> the woman, meanwhile, was arrested and charged with aggravated domestic battery. Her bail was set at $100,000. Wow. Mm-hmm. Guess mm-hmm. what? Race. You Post. want a French kiss? Potus, you got this. <laughs> Ah, uh, yeah, I think it's Mexican. Oh, I'm going to go with Latino. Okay. Yeah, tongue tortilla. Yeah. <laughs> tongue tortilla! <laughs> Empanadas, I chorizo. Got your papers. <laughs> your tongue papers. <laughs> um, I, I think th- th- this is a tough one, but I got to think it's some type of Southeast Asian. They they, mm. like, to, oh. they like to eat strange things. So you think she went in for the kill or like for food? Yeah, well, yeah, yeah. I mean, there was definitely, uh, you know, she had eating things like that before. Right, because that didn't gross her out. Right. No, no, she had it in the mouth and spit it out. I was like, so yeah. you're going with what? I'm going with, uh, I'm going with Filipino. Filipino. Mm. <laughs> they do like nasty stuff. Mm-hmm. Yeah. 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 All right. I don't want to generalize, but uh, <laughs> TDB. And this game is called Stereotyping. It is. Yeah. Mm, I'm going to go with the third season of True Blood. Mm. Vamp- I'm going zombie and vampire. That would be yeah. Transylvanian? Yeah. White person. Yeah. White. Brunette. Uh, Caucasus uh, Mountains. With yeah, uh, French tips. French tips. <laughs> Widow's Peak. I mm-hmm. want to bite your tongue. Okay. Yeah, I'm going. Vlad. Yeah. What you got? I think she's definitely Spanish. <laughs> ah. So you two think that Latinos are Latino. Latino. That's that hot Spanish blood, man. Probably Very angry. Puerto Rican, Dominican, something. Oh, there like you that. go. Puerto, I like that. Look at you now. <laughs> <laughs> Look at you now. <laughs> you okay. stupid fuck. Yeah, now. <laughs> I don't kill kids, man. <laughs> <laughs> But I do buy fucking tongues, man. <laughs> you want to fuck on me? The woman... How'd you like that? The woman who wanted to make sure that mouth couldn't do any more damage... <laughs> ah, was she asked what that mouth do. A 47... I'm sorry. 51-year-old white woman. Oh! Whoa. Shit, y'all missed that. Yeah, she's Jeffrey white. Dahmer's sister. I'm going to throw that in the Franks and Beans. <laughs> Franks and Beans. The Franks and Beans. I kind of got white like when he like, you know, he thought to like pack the tongue in the back. <laughs> there you go with the, the ice. ice. Right. Black eye would have just knocked her out. I'm going to get you away, Susan. I think even a Latin guy would have probably killed her as well. <laughs> you know, very yeah. passionate people. Oh, oh my God. God. That is All right, sick. ready for the next one. Yes. A man fed his two-month-old baby bleach because he heard it could help with the baby's congestion. Oh, my God. Where did he hear that from? According to a police report, the child's mother went to the child's room after she heard the baby crying. The child spit up a clear liquid that smelled Hmm? like bleach. Sorry, my tongue. Uh, She called (laughs) 911, and the child was taken to the hospital. A hospital employee called the uh, police. You smell the baby bottle and it smells like complete bleach. And the parents aren't giving us, us a good story mm. on how it got in there. The caller told 911. Police said the father broke down crying at the police station and admitted to putting bleach in this child's bottle, saying he heard from a friend in school that it works at a as a medicinal cure. Right. He said he mixed 
less than a cap full of bleach with less than two ounces of formula. Mm. He did go on Damn. to say, this would probably be the dumbest decision I ever made in my life. I regret it 110%. And I need some of that back for my whites. Guess Hello. what, Grace? <laughs> Sad. Mm. The baby lives. It's all right. I, I feel it was like clean, very this clean is too. white. I feel white on this you feel one. white? Why would yeah. you say white? Mm, I don't know. I just, I don't know. I think it's white. Mm. Okay. Asian dry cleaner. <laughs> <laughs> um, I, it's not. It's definitely not a black person because y'all are like good at like wives' tales and shit like that. Like, <laughs> Hysterical, you know. So y'all would definitely know that bleach is not going to help the baby. Right. Um, <laughs> <laughs> home remedies. <laughs> yeah, home remedies. That is not home remedy. Uh, and who's stupid enough to take this advice? Uh, but yet still be in school. That's confusing to me. Sounds white to me. Sounds very crackerish. I'm definitely going re- uh, a redneck. Redneck. Yeah, I'm going mm. south. Uh, That's a Alabama. subspecies. That's not really. L.A. Right. Lower Alabama. Okay, West Virginia. Okay, <laughs> Tater. I'm gonna go Egyptian. Egyptian. This bleach is new over there, so they really don't want to use it. <laughs> okay. So I'm gonna go Egyptian. They don't use on the Egyptian so. cotton. Cleans right. the flying carpet though. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Vlad. Vlad. I, I would say that. Uh, that he's Greek. Greek. Oh, he's doing monkey wrench. Remember, like that one, the dad and my big fat Greek wedding that would like spray <laughs> everything with Windex. Ah, <laughs> like, okay. spraying the baby's yeah. mouth. Exactly. Gestapo and Monopoly. Watch type, those Greeks. Okay. Same type of thing. All Greek. right. Okay. Everybody's locked in. Yeah. Egyptian. The hmm. man who used bleach on his colors was a twenty-year-old black man. Oh, what? what? You like that bleach on his colors? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Really? I know that's wrong. Yeah. yeah. No, no, I have a good. picture of him too. Yeah, uh, maybe if you would have said 20 year old, I don't know. That's, yeah, that's, oh, I don't understand that. Okay. I, I have one more if you guys want to do one. Mm, yep. Do one more. One more. One Hilarious. More. Thanks, Polis. <laughs> Thanks. All right, I didn't really edit this one, Thanks, so I got to just bear with me. Okay. A man and his girlfriend got into a fight about the man scratching his testicles while sitting on the couch of their home with where they lived as boyfriend and girlfriend. The woman told the man to stop the rude and disgusting behavior. Because she was about to eat. <laughs> Meaning, please stop scratching your nutsack. You want some Parmesan cheese on that? <laughs> At that point, uh, the woman got up and started to get... I'm sorry, the man got up and the woman started to get in his face. He yelled at her to stop judging him. <laughs> He's only scratching his balls. <laughs> she told Deputy that the man pushed her into the kitchen, which caused her to fall to the ground, scrape her ankle, Mm-mm. before grabbing her and throwing her outside on the curb. He told her to get the hell out. Uh, so basically, yeah, they got into a fight over the scratching of the balls. Mm. I'm going to have to go with black on that one. Oh. Black, okay. You have a problem with Guys scratching no, their balls? No, they scratch their balls. Oh, okay. Did they have company? I mean, I if there know. was other people over there. Was it a Super Bowl party? Uh, I'd yeah, feel well, some kind of way. Well, there's but three of us involved in this party. my man and I at home, yeah, yeah he could what? scratch his balls if they itch. It was just oh. a, But she was about to eat, and he probably did it like right over her food. Oh, okay. <laughs> I don't want no pubes in my <laughs> shit, though. <laughs> Try this crust. It's delicious. <laughs> what kind of pasta is this? <laughs> so you said what now? I, I said black. Black, okay. I'm confused with this. Um, yeah, I didn't really edit it well. Uh, I'm going to say, uh, I'm, I'm just going to stick with Caucasian today. Yeah? Mm. I'm going to blame us for everything. We like that, okay. I mean, and we, I, I mean, I like to scratch my nuts, so. But would you do it when your girlfriend was eating? Over? Uh, no. Okay. <laughs> TDP. When she wasn't looking, I'd do it. <laughs> scratch, his, mm. scratch his balls and then reach for something on her What's plate? that over there? Scratchy, scratchy. Uh, I'm going to go Lithuanian. Lithuanian? Yeah. Why? What are Eastern European, I like that. I think scratching the balls is new over there. It's a new phenomenon. <laughs> oh, God. And she's not really ready because she doesn't have any balls. So. She's old school. She's old, she's she's old school. Conventionally. Thank you. She's yeah, old she's school. a lady. He's a lady. Who else is going to scratch them? Yes. Okay. All right, we got Helga. you. Helga. Lithuanian. <laughs> Vlad. Probably like Eastern European. Okay. Mm. You know, Eastern European men are kind of hairy. So, you know. <laughs> <laughs> you had hairy balls? You know. <laughs> it's hairy, period. <laughs> Okay. You know, so they, they tend to scratch more. So there you go, cool. Eastern European. All right. I did forget to tell you guys that um, he, he was charged with a simple battery. Okay. Mm. The man who could not resist scratching his sack was a 30 year old biracial man. Oh, black. Wow. Yeah, black. We'll go with black. One drop yeah. makes him black. One. 
Yeah. All He's right. black. Light skin. Right. Hilarious. This has been another edition of <laughs> Guess What Race. And we are going to take a quick back and a break. What? <laughs> Hold up. What? Whoa, what'd you say? Take it to the back. <laughs> and this coochie is falling out the And back come back head. with scrambled eggs, eggs and, and Pam. Oh. Somebody bite your tongue, Carl. And we in the mix with DJ. <laughs> DJ always. always. Shout out to DJ always. You know what that sound means. It means Reach Round Radio is going on a cruise. It's possible. Oh, it's possible, my brother. Join Reach Round Radio and the whole crew. Hey, it's cruise time. We got an update. August 10th through the 15th. That's August 10th through the 15th. Go to TeamRAR.com for more details. The Reach Around Radio Cruise with DJ Always, Poet is Speedy, Claudia Jordan, TDP, and Toop might be gone. Team RAR, huh? Where are we leaving from? We leaving out of Miami. August 10th through the 15th. Five days of fun and a whole lot of fun. And where are we going? To Jamaica, little darling. We're going to Jamaica. To find out more information about the RAR Comedy Cruise, go to our website, TeamRAR.com, and click the link that says Cruise to Jamaica. To book the cruise, call 560. 560- 1890 or email divine public relations at gmail.com and you guaranteed to be on the ship and book early because the RAR comedy cruise will be sold out remember go to team RAR.com or divine public relations.com and call 562-774-1890 come get your cruise on punk are you a diabetic? Need some energy? Need to quench your thirst? Try Pitbull Sugar-Free Energy Drink, the only energy drink named suitable for diabetics by the American Diabetic Association. And it's now available with no calories, no carbs, no sugar, and no fat, and a smooth, natural blend of energy, vitamins, and minerals. Need to quench your thirst? Try Pitbull Sugar-Free Energy Drink, the only energy drink named suitable for diabetics by the American Diabetic Association. And it's now available with no calories, no carbs, no sugar, and no fat, and a smooth, natural blend of energy, vitamins, and minerals. Pitbull Sugar-Free Energy Drink is the healthiest, best-tasting energy drink around. For more information and online ordering with free shipping, please visit hiphopbev.com. Remember, Pitbull Sugar-Free Energy Drink, suitable for diabetics, great for everyone.